Hello everyone and welcome back to the Minecraft video and for this video I'm going to be doing sort of like a new episode. It's going to be plant versus zombies. Um, you can already see a few plants down here. Um, I'm going to be doing maybe 20 episodes or so but this is the first episode and the first edition I'm going to call is the White House edition. Um, today we're going to be doing three levels, level one, level two and level three. You can kind of see that the zombies will spawn over there and then I'm going to have to place flowers depending on the sort of flowers I have in those chests just right at the back over there and once they reach the end they will have um, obviously depending on the difficulty as you can see it's one, two, three um, eventually it will stay at three for a few levels and then go to four, five and eventually it will all be filled up with pressure plates to open the doors for the zombies to eat the villagers but then obviously inside you can also see we have some repeaters um, which will shoot pods out and you can kind of see we have four in this one, three in this one and then another three so eventually it will have one and then none at all and then also our zombies that we're going to be spawning today they will be different for each level as they get harder and harder I will be um, spawning more and more zombies some of them really different to each other like for example we have the night zombie we have the gargantua zombie so it's going to be really interesting but before we get started, I think it's a good idea to kind of um, show you guys what this little um, mod and everything will do for us. This is a custom made map, so as you can see I've made it myself. Um, it's very awesome and it's very cool. If you want to download the White House um, map, there will be a link in the description and there will be links to the mods in the description down below. So I think we should get started and we should see what sort of flowers we have today. So let's see what we have for level 1. We have a pea shooter seed packet, so let's get those out. We have a sunflower seed packet, a repeater seed packet, a snow pea seed packet, a spikeweed seed packet, wow, really cool, a three peter seed packet, a peanut seed packet, a walnut seed packet, and a potato mine seed packet. And as we go on in the levels, we will get less and less plants until eventually we have maybe like a few plants and quite a few zombies to kill. Um, but eventually there will be like obstacles in the path, so the zombies will have to go around. My plants will have to be placed in really good locations once um, there's like obstacles in the way. And then eventually we will download other things, for example, other mods to kind of add to this little series. So I think we should get started. And these pea shooter seed packets, I know they shoot really far. So as always, I'm going to be placing them quite far back. So we can place 10. So this is one. Let's do two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Then we do, um, let's see what we should do. Eight, nine, and let's just do 10 here. Good. And now we've got sunflowers. Now these sunflowers, every so often they will spawn suns. And once we have about 10 suns, we can then buy another seed packet for a harder level. So we can place five of these, one, two, three, four, five. It doesn't matter where they go because they don't shoot. They will eventually spawn suns, like there you go. I'm not gonna pick that up right now just because um, I wanna save them up for later. And by the time we finish this episode, by the time we place those zombies, I come in and collect all of the suns. And then eventually for the harder episodes, I can cash in those suns for pretty much more flowers for future episodes. So let's go ahead and place the next ones. We have five of these, which is the repeater seed packets. As you can see, these have um, kind of like double shots. So we can place five of these. One, two, three, four, five. And then we have these snow ones, five of these, one, two, three, four, five, perfect. We have these spike seed packets. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna place these kind of like right here. One, two, three, four, and five. The reason I've done it like this is because sometimes they can avoid them very well. So if I place something like this, they'll have to walk over two um, if they go this way, or if this one, if they walk over this way, they place two, and that one there is in case they're trying to you know, get away from it, but they can't because there's still one there. So then we have four of these. Gosh, we're gonna have so many. One, two, three, four. Then three of these peanut seed packets. I'm gonna place these near the beginning. This is basically like zombie food. So they will go for these and these will shoot them back. So it's gonna be pretty crazy. And we've got three of these, walnuts, one, two, three, there we go. And three mines, wow. So let's do one, two, three, there we go. So let's put all these back in our chests. Here we go. Let's put all these back. 
And let's get started on our first episode. So this is going to be pretty crazy. So let's see what we have. We have to place 10 bucket zombies, uh, or bucket head zombies, 5 flag zombies, 5 imp zombies, five gar uh, 1 gargantua zombie, sorry, 5 football zombies, um, 5 peasant zombies, 5 peasant bucket head zombies, wow, 5 peasant flag zombies, and then 5 knight zombies. If they manage to get those villagers, it means we've lost and we'll have to restart the level or we'll go on. And if we fail three times, this whole series will kind of end. So that's gonna be quite, you know, a shame. So let's get rid of this chest because they can jump over um, and go on the other side. So we get rid of that. And right here, what I will do in just as, let me just get rid of this gargantua. And um, this is kind of like the floor in this little map. Um, I'm gonna have to place something there, there we go. Um, so let's go ahead and get rid of that, there we go. And we're going to have to set the time. So time set to 22,000 for night time. There we go. And you guys ready? Let's spawn 10 zombies. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, we place uh, one too many, but that doesn't matter. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then a gargantua. Then a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then 5, uh, z z 2, 3, 4, 5, perfect, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 5 more, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, perfect, so let's see what's happening here, this is absolutely crazy, look at this, wow, one of them's making it, he's making it, that is crazy, and some of these things I was accidentally shooting the villagers. Oh my days. I did not foresee that. That is crazy. So here we go. Oh, they've almost made it through. Whoa, they almost made it. And as you can see here, they've started to destroy some of these. As you can see, the three Peter is at one health. Some of these ones are a bit lost, I've noticed. Like, look at them. They're, they're like trying to run away or something. Who knows what they're trying to do. Whoa, and look at this um, gargantua one. A hundred life points. That is crazy. And why are they burning? Oh my days, why are they burning? Let's go there. Time set 18,000. There we go. That should kind of help them out a little bit. Whoa. Now this is the first level, guys. So obviously in every single game, always in your first levels, you kind of are meant, you know, to do really well. And I think we've done really well. Only a few of these um, snow peas were destroyed. Um, a few of these were destroyed, these repeaters. We have quite a few of those destroyed. Um, this peasant flag zombie is not going to make it. Now we all know what's going to happen to these zombies. As soon as they get close, they are going to be starting to get destroyed. They really only do well in crowds. So as you can see here, this walnut one, uh, it seems to be some sort of wall. So they have to go around. So we know that for the future now. There you go. He went over that. He got slowed down and he's dead. Now we know that these two zombies are... Oh, look at those bees in there. That is crazy. So let's move on to the next one. So what we can do is we can put these... We can't open that. There we go. Let's put these in there. Perfect. Great. That is great. So now, what we can do is we can go on this side, and this says the zombies start here once again. And we have different zombies now, so that's going to be pretty crazy. And let's see what we have here. We have a pea shooter, five of those, only five this time. A five repeater one. Five walnuts, so we can create some sort of like barricade. A hypno shroom. A peanut one a snow one, we have a spiked weed, a three-peater, and a fume shroom. So this is going to be insane. So let's go ahead. Oh, and we really have maybe our first obstacle. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Um, so let's place five of these. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Five of these. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, walnuts. So we have to place these. I want to kind of get them away. So let's do one, two, and then to do three, four, five. So they now have to kind of, kind of walk in this formation in a V formation to get to the inside. And we have a hypno shroom. So let's do one, two, three, four, five. Five of these. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, snow ones. Should we place them at the back with the rest of them? Yeah, let's do one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Um, we have these. Now, this is perfect. We can do one, two, three, four, five. And wow, we have five of these. These are really nice ones. I'm going to place them right at the back this time. Just because last time, quite a few of them got through. Um, I'm quite scared of that. 
And then we do five of these, one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. And wow, it looks a lot more cleaner than the ones out back there. <laughs> it was crazy back then. Um, so let's go ahead and put all these back. There we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. And let's go ahead and put another stone on top of that right there. And right here, what I'll do is I'll place um, some stone like this, just so no one can jump up. Because last time they jumped up and it was kind of annoying. Um, so let's go ahead and get rid of this. There we go. And we have 10 peasant zombies, 10 gargantuas, 10 football zombies, or 5 football zombies, 5 peasant buckethead zombies, 2 explorer zombies, 2 newspaper zombies, 10 knight zombies, 5 imp monks, and 2 engineers. Okay, <laughs> you guys ready? Let's go ahead. So we have to place 10. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And we have two of these, one, two, five of these, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two of these, two newspaper ones, one, two, wow, those ran off, look at those. Oh, we have to hurry up, come on, one, two, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we've done this to peasant zombies. Here we go. Let's see what's happening right here. Wow, they've made it through already. That is crazy. Gosh, this is insane. Let's go in this view here. Whoa, and we have to set the time. Set 18,000 again. There we go. Gosh, they can almost make it by this last row but then this last row here they won't make, be able to make it across um, just because these are really intense wow they've already destroyed one peanut they've destroyed one of these um, fume shrooms wow these gargantuas and they've been attacked by the other ones it's crazy let's see oh this uh, brainwashed zombie he's not very happy at all that is crazy let's see gosh this is so intense are they going to destroy another peanut they are going for it, look at them. Slowly by slowly they're going for it. But they keep on getting hit back and they don't seem to be able to make it across this little front porch here. Wow, these gargantuas. Oh, here it goes. Oh, he makes it and then he gets shot down insanely. So this football one. Oh, he's going for it. He is going for it. Oh, I was like, is no one seeing him? What's going on here? That is crazy. Okay, here we go. Now they seem to be able to destroy a few of them, but then they just don't make it past. And then obviously as they die down, they get so much easier to kill. And there's obviously less and less chances for them to go across as they start to die. So, wow, what's going on here? Is he being attacked by this brainwashed zombie? That is insane. This brainwashed zombie, who, who is he? Where did he come from? That is absolutely crazy. Okay, wow. Okay, I think we all know that we have won this one. And we are going to be doing so well. Oh, here comes a little imp zombie. Oh, and he stopped. He realized how dangerous this was. And we already have like a flag zombie appearing over there. And we have some zombies over here. So, hmm. And I knew that in future episodes we're going to have skeletons and everything. So that's going to be really cool. He doesn't seem to be able to be destroyed at all. Hmm. Maybe we should just uh, help them out. One, two, there we go. There you go, fella. Off you go. Dead, dead, dead. Perfect, and we have one more left. Um, this little guy has no chance of getting across, to be honest. We all know this for sure. So let's just destroy him, just so he doesn't destroy our next match. One, two, there we go, perfect. So let's go over to, um, let's, well, let's put these in the chests, I guess. There we go, perfect. And let's see what we have on our final one. So zombies start here once again, and then let's see what sort of plants we have. Whoa, we have so little this time. We have 10 magnet shroom uh, seeds, which kind of like attract the zombies to them. We have the puff uh, shroom. We have the scared shroom seed packet. We have the fume shroom. We have the hypno shroom. 10 potato mines and five sun shrooms. Well, okay, so let's go ahead and place these. Okay, this doesn't seem to be very um, intense, this last one. This is going to be crazy. Let's just do one, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You see what I did there, like a V formation? I'm hoping this works. Um, so let's do one, two, three, four, five. Five more, let's put these behind. 
one, two, three, four, five. Let's do these five other ones right at the back here in case they get through. One, two, three, four, five. Then five more. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, these ones. This is going to be pretty cool. I'm going to place them all by the middle. So let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then five of these sun streams, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so let's see what sort of zombies we have now. Um, the sun is coming up once again, so we're going to have to be quite quick in getting out our zombies. But then I can kind of go back in time, so it's fine. So let's go ahead and see what zombies we have. We have 10 explorer zombies, 10 dragon imps, and 10 gargantuas. So it doesn't seem to be that many, and I don't know why there isn't that many. Um, if it's too easy, maybe we can start again on this one. Oh, we got some more suns appearing there. That's so cool. Comment till we have 10. So let's go ahead and do time set 18,000. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This is just like... Baby dragons wearing dragon suits. Um, baby dragons, baby zombies. Gosh, they're making it. No wonder they started this episode. Oh my days. This is insane. Oh my days, they've completely eaten everything. This is insane, oh my days. Oh, have we lost this one? Now when they get in, they will be destroyed by these repeaters. So, gosh, what is going on there? Oh, I forgot to put those things on those chests, but I guess we were losing on this one anyways. Look at that. They've made it through. The only chance they have is if they get destroyed by the repeaters. Gosh. Here they go. Oh, they're coming in. Oh, here they go. Oh, my days. These zombies are freaking out. <laughs> oh, these villagers. Oh, there goes one. Let's see. Well, honestly, I just, they don't, they're not going to make it. We all know this. Look how much life points they have. Here we go. Oh, my days. Oh, this was so hard. Did I not prepare well for this? And look, all the mines. They didn't get destroyed at all. So what happened? I don't get it. Gosh. Guys, we lost on this last one. Oh, my days. That is so sad. Um, oh, That is crazy. So just to finish off, let's just destroy that. There we go. There we go. They can all get destroyed. Oh, that is absolutely crazy. And I thought we would do so well on this last one. I was like, okay, there's a few gargantuas, but they're very slow. You know, we had a very high chance of killing them. These brainwashed, brainwashed zombies actually helped me out for some reason. It's so weird. So to finish off, I'm going to be getting all our suns. So here we go. So we have 26, which means we can get two for the next one. Here we go. Perfect. Gosh, so we can get 6, 12, 18, 21 extra zombies for future episodes. Oh, wait, maybe a few more. So we can get, so because it's every 10, um, we can get an extra sort of either brainwash zombie or another plant. So we can get 6, 12, 18, 21 extra plants or brainwash zombies for the next episodes. So that's going to be so cool. 21 extra ones, that's crazy. And to be honest, I think we're going to need it now because we've already lost on the first episode on our last little track. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please post them below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you all very soon with the next episode of our Plant vs. Zombies. Peace out.